<laughs> I got them too. <laughs> Would you change your curtains depending on the planet and number rule in a particular year? <coughs> I hope you guys are not seeing mine. It is also the second largest and it has some beautiful rings surrounding it. <laughs> it's influ <laughs> I posted a shot today asking you guys to get ready with me to the Makola market. Yeah, so basically I'm back from the market and I want to reveal to you what's in my shopping bag, which is obviously a bag pack, okay? So yeah, let's get right into it. It's no wastage of time, okay? Actually, the main reason that I went there, I couldn't get it because I had to go to the office to visit my boss and my colleagues like it's been a long time that i've seen them so yeah i was basically going to get me a bleach a hair bleach i want to bleach my hair yeah period but i'll be going to get that tomorrow okay yeah so let's get right into the video this is what i got i couldn't get those things because after visiting my boss like the shops were closed i didn't you know get there on time so the first thing is a curtain that's the major thing i got okay yeah every year you know i do change my curtains do you understand like i i go according to the theme color of each year do you understand because i've associated myself with some um friends who practice this indian culture teach us a lot of these things about numerology and astrology so i try to sometimes comply the ones that i can yeah especially when it comes to the color of the day and colors of the year i do go according to those because those are the easiest that i can so this i got me a black curtain black and ash but the major color is black because this year is ruled by certain since this year when you add the digits of 2024 everything adds up to eight eight is a very slow number people who are number eight basically they go through a lot of challenges in life and they require a lot of discipline and you know being responsible and a lot of hard work to make it in life yeah so the same thing applies to certain number eight is ruled by certain and certain rule by you know that kind of thing like the two are directly proportional certain is equal to eight yeah with this year we need a lot of structure in our life we need we need a lot of discipline we need a lot of hard work we need to be responsible so basically certain has a lot of influence on career authority and long-term goals you know people who have certain in their bed charts okay it shows how you face your challenges how you resolve the challenges and how you work towards your long-term goals and you know working towards your long-term goals it involves a lot of discipline and hard work that is basically what certain is about in numerology is associated with number eight and astrology it deals with lots of discipline responsibility and structure okay so a lot of hard work needs to be done and the theme color for 2024 which is ruled by number eight and definitely by certain is black is black so that is the reason i've gotten me a black curtain do you understand so yeah this is a set two and the other set this is the other set as well so i want to be changing my curtains i had white curtains i don't know if you have watched some of my videos had my curtains that i used in 2023 2023 was ruled by k2 is a malefic planet and you will see its effect in your life depending on where it's placed in your birth chart okay so like i was saying last year i said i used white curtains because it was ruled by number seven which is directly associated with um k2 so i was saying that k2 is a planet of detachment spirituality and introspection introspection in that you are able to examine your mental and emotional processes when you have you know k2 in your birth charts you may have 
uh, psychic abilities intuition and a lot of insight into past life okay that is what basically k2 deals with and so last year i used the team color which is white or orange and i prefer to use white and scientifically k2 is the same as neptune which is the eighth planet <laughs> do you understand so if you have saturn in your birth chart you need a lot of discipline and you need to be responsible and you need to work hard to make it do you understand and scientifically saturn is like the sixth planet on the solar system it is also the second largest and it has some beautiful rings surrounding it do you understand it's not the only planet with rings but you know it's the only planet with beautiful spectacular icy rings given that this year is ruled by saturn and is number eight and saturn's color is black i've gone for this beautiful curtain so yeah um after this video you see it's at the background that's what you see at the background so yeah the next thing in my <laughs> in my shopping uh bag is this you know yeah i got this for myself you guys <laughs> look at them i guess they are pretty let me just try it for you to see i hope you guys are not seeing my <laughs> see how does it look if you look at it i don't know but that is it i got this you know yeah i don't know if you can see it yeah that is the second thing in my shopping bag and what else what else did i get you know some of the things i got them and this thing this this leopard fabric leopard design fabric i think i'll just use it on my bed at the tail end of my bed yeah yeah probably that's all i think that's all what else is here <laughs> this is pepper <laughs> and what and what and what else did i get oh my goodness oh, oh my god <laughs> okay 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 and this you guys see dried fish i don't know if you can see hey i'm putting the fish on my bed to see dried fish yeah <coughs> jesus <laughs> yeah yeah so that was all i got from the market and you know i'll be fixing the curtains you know after fixing them i'll holler you guys to see how they look in the background so i'll get back to you in a jiffy you <laughs> guys i forgot to show you this so i got this tea attire <laughs> and look at me <laughs> the woman who sold it she was selling this thing cola nuts so <laughs> i got them too <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay guys so this is the final settings of the room like you can see it from the background i feel it's beautiful yeah what do you think this is a final outlook of the room okay so yeah it's beautiful but i feel like the the length is okay the length of the curtain is okay but the breadth is not wide enough you know the one i was using previously was a very wide so yeah i could see the folds i always want to see the folds in my curtains i don't know if you understand what i mean these things these things the foldings yeah i love to see them but they are not big enough i need to spread it wide so that it can cover all the windows but the previous one was very wide so you know i didn't need to spread it 
and also the white one that i was using previously it made the room looked as though it was very spacious it looked as though it was very spacious but this time the black one you know the room is now looking a bit claustrophobic in that it has become more confined yeah that's what i think yeah as you can see the outlook that the darker color has made it more confined it's just one room that i have my bed here my fridge here my couch here my wardrobe my working table my everything is in this room so i try as much to organize the things and structure them in such a way that i always have space because like when there's not enough space i, I feel you know i don't feel right i feel claustrophobic there's some kind of claustrophobia when i i am in a very confined space so i try as much to create space in my room so yeah that is it would you change your curtains depending on the planet and number rule in a particular year if you would drop a comment down below and let me know i have been living astrology and numerology so much so that oh my goodness <laughs> i don't know i don't know yeah but if you would change your curtains due to a particular year's number drop a comment down below and let me know so here comes the end of our video i hope you learned a thing or two and you love it so if you do give it a big thumbs up and i love you so much <laughs>